ஆழ்வார் பெருமானார் ஜி ஆர் திருவடிகளே சரணம் ஜி ஆர் திருவடிகளே சரணம் சுவாமி அடியன் ஹேட் அ கொஸ்டின் ஃப்ரம் ஒன் ஆஃப் யுவர் லெக்சர்ஸ் where you were saying uh, manavala mamanigal was constantly reciting the dwayam mantram but in his mind he was thinking the meanings of thiruvaimuri is there a reason to recite dwayam and think the meanings rather than you know reciting directly the asuras and think the meanings oh see for uh, for shri vishnuvas uh, it is emphasized that japtavyam guru paramparayam dwayam so we must be constantly um reciting guru parampara mantram that is asmat guru bhyo namaha asmat parama guru bhyo namaha that sequence after that the dwaya maha mantram so this is the japam for us every sampradaya has some kind of japam for shri vishnuvas we should be constantly doing japa yes japa is something which uh, engages the mind and body and uh, speech together so that is why japa is emphasized so when uh, when the lips are reciting when man should be thinking about something and uh, dwaya maha mantram's explanation is tiruvaimudi actually if you look at uh, tiruvaimudi uh, its connection with uh, many uh, tiruvaimudi dwaya maha mantram gadhyam sharanagadi gadhyam and uh, um, shri vaikuntha gadhyam shri ranga gadhyam and then shri vachana bhushanam all of these are interrelated so tiruvaimudi is related to uh, shri vachana bhushanam dwaya maha mantram is related to shri vachana bhushanam dwaya maha mantram is related to tiruvaimudi so um, when we are reciting the mantra our mind should be thinking something and that something is uh, mainly tiruvaimudi because the tiruvaimudi has all the essential principles six examples uh, example artha panchakam and then it talks about um, dwaya maha mantrams elaboration and so many different aspects are there hence while doing japa uh, because just uh, um, plain japa is not recommended in our sampradayam just having japa mala and uh, reciting some mantra that is not um, recommended in our sampradayam japa should be something natural like when whenever we are not doing anything else like let's say we are reciting pasarams we are um, uh, speaking about bhagavan or we are listening to lectures so these times our mind and body are engaged in this and speech is also engaged but other times when we are free we should automatically start reciting uh, dwaya maha mantram guru guru parampara and dwaya maha mantram and then when we are reciting we should be thinking about the meanings in our mind so this is why um, mantra ratna anusandana santata spurita dharam tadatta tatva nidhyana sannadha kulakodgamam in that shlokam erumbi appa says that manavar mamnigal is always reciting dwaya maha mantram and he is always thinking about the meanings of dwaya maha mantram which is tiruvaimudi and uh, tiruvaimudi also it is not just uh, manavar mamnigal was thinking about the pasurams he is got the whole ed vyakhyana memorized so he was constantly thinking about the passages from ed vyakhyana and uh, totally immersed in the anubhavam and that is why it reflects in his body with goosebumps and uh, flowing tears and so on ஆழ்வார் என் பெருமானார் ஜி ஆர் திருவடிகளே சரணம் ஜி ஆர் திருவடிகளே சரணம் டு லேர்ன் சச் வேல்யூபிள் இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் அபவுட் அவர் ஸ்ரீ வைஷ்ணவ சம்பிரதாய பிளீஸ் டவுன்லோட் கோயில் கே ஓ வை ஐ எல் ஆப் ஃப்ரம் கூகுள் பிளே ஸ்டோர் ஆர் ஆப்பிள் ஆப் ஸ்டோர் அவர் வெப்சைட் இஸ் கோயில் டாட் ஆர்க் கே ஓ வை ஐ எல் டாட் ஓஆர்ஜி